I love learning about how plants grow and how it goes into our food and how energy works. As you all know, here at Pomeroy Elementary, we have an amazing garden to table program. We have this amazing partnership with our families and outside resources as well to make this community garden a wonderful place. And really, we call it the heart of our school because it's a place where all kids, all staff, everyone can go to and they have hands-on experiences, these learning moments that everyone can experience. It doesn't matter if you're four in TK or you're 10 in fifth grade. I have probably the best job ever. I get to teach TK through fifth graders the whole process from planting a seed through how plants grow to what they taste like, how we can change them through cooking. We cover all the subjects from obviously math and science. We do a lot of projects here in the makerspace and we talk a lot about how food can be transformed and how it helps our bodies and how we can improve our ecosystem here. Each year builds the skills on the next so by the time a fifth grader goes through everything that's seven years of skills, hands-on practical skills that they've learned. Hands-on learning is so important for kids because we know that kids can sit and learn in a classroom but we know that they learn better when they're engaged when they're able to build, take apart things, when they're able to construct things, when they can get their hands dirty. And in the garden, you have visual, you have taste, you have smell, you have touch, you have all of the senses. It just awakens the learning for kids and provides so many opportunities to build vocabulary, to build collaborative skills, to problem solve together, to be creative. All of our English learners are right there doing things side by side, learning new vocabulary alongside their English only counterparts. And so they really, they get to build their skills together. In our cooking classes, we utilize something called a Charlie cart. We use it here in our makerspace. It's a mobile kitchen and it allows us to take an entire class of kids and walk them through a recipe it has all of the things we need for measuring and it allows us to try out different flavor combinations and cook things that are seasonal and healthy for kids. In our latest garden class, we learned how the sun will give energy to example a plant and then an animal will eat the plant and then if we eat the animal, we will consume that energy like it's all connected in a food chain. One of my favorite things that I've learned is like one of the most more recent lessons we've had is like talking about the food web and how it can be arranged in different orders. And I thought that was very interesting. They would do like really fun activities to learn about how growing and plants and cooking and how everything is kind of connected and how it works. If a kid grows a vegetable and then cooks that vegetable, they are so much more likely to eat that vegetable and then to continue on for the rest of their life. One of my favorite things is when a kid asks me if they can have more vegetables on their plate. And I always say, yes, please, you definitely can. 